to look good on video and Tyler was hoping you'd shoot that wall. I've got one that I get comments on that one all the time. People want to know, you know, what front end I used or what what we did under the hood, stuff like that. Anyway, great little truck. Hey guys, so I've got a YouTube friend over here today. His name is Sam Space 81 on YouTube. Go, be sure to go check out his channel. And uh, we met on YouTube and he actually... cars that we were never gonna sell and um, since that yellow 66 K code has come into our lives over there we've decided we're gonna let go of the 59 Apache so this car is is for sale this 59 Apache and it's um, absolutely amazing it's factory V8 car and we've it's updated with power steering air conditioning um, brakes I mean it's it's incredible and um, it's sad to see it go my daughter's really upset about it <laughs> but it's gonna be it's for sale so you can find that on our website Great. And, uh, I hate to see it go too we, we call it Apache Red she's beautiful dad dad says it's a double deluxe he kind of coined the term double deluxe and what that means is it's got the Deluxe fleet side bed with the chrome on the spears, and it's got the deluxe cab with all the chrome trim on the cab. So it's kind of the most decked out engine, uh, optioned out 59 Apache you can get. Real subtle upholstery, I like the seat. Yeah, Dad and I's style is real I like it. original. We don't Heistful. like to get too pimpy on anything. <laughs> pimpy? Yeah. <laughs> One of the, you know, we, we joke about it. We call them, um, like, all you know all those tri-fives when you go to the car shows? All the old guys have their 57 Chevys with everything chrome under the hood and swoopy leather interior. and We call them Jolly Ranchers. They're just pimped out, you know, and they don't look like the original gotcha. cars that they were. Yeah. And we really like the original look. That's what let's, we always say. Let's get a peek under the hood. Okay, yeah, check it out, man. This is beautiful. Runs like a top. Hey, I appreciate you showing me around. Yeah, I'm glad I'm not, to have you here. I'm not me. keeping you from anything, am I? No, we're Just good. Showing up unannounced. No, we're good, man. We're good. I was telling my audience outside that my client actually found an ad for a, a set of wheels that you guys had. Yeah, I know. That's and crazy. Me and you had had communications yep. there on YouTube. Yep. Talking about doing some collaborations yeah, and meeting up. Yeah, it's so up. cool to have a, a local guy who's into YouTube, too, and classic cars and everything. Yep. Meeting a fellow car buff YouTuber. Yeah. So we got the V8 and air conditioning, power steering, and just real clean. This is a sweet truck. Like I said, this one my dad was doing for himself. It's simple, reliable. Yep. Small block Chevy. Yep. Carbureted. Hard to beat, man. Good uh, and clean. Looks uh, like we got power. Now this GMC, that looks like a honey. She's beautiful. Man. She calls it Cherry Bomb. You can see she put that sticker on the rear window. That's the name of the truck. Look at the front end. There's just so much to soak in. Yeah, to me the grill on the, the, the front grill is just killer. And the emblems. Man, so much design and style Man, back then. That's a hunk of steel right there. Now what year is this one, a 58, 9? I think this is 58. Could be fit. Oh man, 
Now you're catching me flat footed. Uh oh. I can't remember. It's a 58 or a 59. Dad will be able to tell you better than I can. Is he here today? Yeah, he's here. We will say hi to him a little bit. We will. Good. I'm going to get in trouble for not knowing if this is a 58. Let's go surprise him. It's one of those deals. It's got some updates. Yeah. Yeah, this does have some updates. Um, in fact, I can't really remember. I didn't spend a lot of time with this one. This one came in and, and left real quick, but it's got, got air the, conditioning. It's got some updated uh, brakes. Got the high visibility back window. Yeah, got your big back window. Which is quite useful when you drive these old trucks. You it know, it, you can see out of them. It is. And right. you can compare. We've got it in the same frame. You can look at the smaller window. So right, right. Kind of get people you know what, a look. What, what, what I've found out after years of owning these cars and actually getting out and driving them, believe it or not, I prefer the small window because if you're going to get out and drive them a lot in the hot weather, that big back class, you start to get real hot. And, Absolutely. And, and I, I love the visibility and I like the look of it, but I really like the kind of the shade and little, the, the, the less heat that you get with the small. A little cozier back. here in Texas. That, that sun's rough stuff. Exactly. This is something, you know, I wouldn't have guessed, but it, that's the way it turned out. This is beautiful. Here lives in Canton, Texas. That's my dad. Dad is 86 now, and that's what made me a car guy. That guy right there. That's me sitting next to him in his 66 Corvette. Looking and good. So, Y'all look good in it. Well, thank you. Here's dad back in the day. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Kid. Back in the day. Oh, I love that. Yeah. And then if you're, if you're a real car guy, you'll like all the little tidbits and pieces that you collect over the years being a car guy just seems to accumulate. <laughs> well, I'm glad I finally got to meet you. Yeah, watching, pleasure. Watching your videos for years. Oh, man, that's high praise. Yeah. I've been watching y'all. Tyler here reached out to me here recently. Yeah, found you know, on YouTube. We've been communicating on a YouTube. and our... What's the story on this massive table? Dude, this thing. i got to show people right this, well, this table. Cool. So this, that's not a skin there. That's actually a solid piece of metal. That, that thing. It's completely solid. Looks like it weighs more and than a car. The, the base, the base is about an inch thick. Well, the second piece right here is yeah. eight inches. This, this, this is all solid. Um, it weighs about 6,000 pounds, what we're told. Wow. It's, it's going to live and die here. You'll never get it out. So we use it as a table, but as you can see, this entrance right here, we have some stuff underneath it, but when there's a tornado alert, the whole family gets under, <laughs> this, crawl table. under this table. Nothing's going to take I that think down. The table's going to stay here. Absolutely. If everything else goes, the table stays. So it's a Texas tornado shelter uh, for us and a little. Uh, <laughs> Project table. You know, this if, is, if I need to bang around on something pretty hard, this table doesn't get it. It can take it. It can yeah. take it. it this is our break room, room, Sam, and this is where we goof off, which is very rare. Oh, yeah, let's, let's have here, a look. Let me show you something over here. This is really cool. I, I love this. It's a lot to take in. This is Larry Shinoda signed oh, these for famous. us. He's the guy who designed the Stingray bodies and also had a lot to do with the Mustang body design. Uh, for the 69 Mustang. Yeah, Boss 302. Boss 302. Uh, so that's that's his signature right there. We got to meet him awesome. at a car show um, way back in the day. But he signed these for us. These are some of his. Let's go get some wheels, guys. I got to get back design. to it. Okay, okay. But if you ever need to do any research, most of these books over here um, are not picture books. They're actually the books that can help you get to the information you need when you're digging for information that matters. So every car guy should gather up books like this uh, because it just helps. But now with the internet, it almost makes this stuff. It's so much, these hardback books, you find so much in them that you don't find on Google. That's true. And they're easier on your eyes. Yep, yep. And I, I found Thank you all for watching. Be sure to check out Tyler and Michael's business, MyRod.com, and we appreciate you here at Sam Space 81. Yeah. That's my kind of track. Baby, it's time to head home. We got the tires in tow. We got the Ford gassed up.
Thanks for watching Sam Space 81. Till next time. Here's my crotch and my leg.